Hello there and welcome to a new let's play of mine. I am the Orange Genius, but you may call me Eric and today we are going to be playing Else Heartbreak by a north or not northern but by a Swedish developer team I guess because they don't really have a studio they are just a like combination of six people six people who worked on this or maybe five I didn't actually count um, they are going to be in the credits though so I give them credit for everything also support from Norden um, this game is a little bit of a narrative title that is pretty much going to be a lot of casual fun casual enjoyment for me i just finished a let's play of hand of fate and that's been really uh, getting to me because it was actually highly skill based and i wanted to play something different next um this is an indie uh, title as uh, you could probably imagine from how many developers there were working on this and it's uh, a little bit of an invent adventure type game with a lot of dialogue to read out which is something i enjoy um i'll definitely be trying to get as much voice acting in there as possible but um if we check out the options menu i already fiddled around with the options a little bit there is this thing called text speed and i don't um the text doesn't progress when I put in that it's supposed to progress the text progresses when um, well a timer has run out so for every speech bubble there is a timer running and I'll have to do my best uh, in terms of you know finding a good voice for the character and reading out everything and it's gonna be interesting that's definitely gonna be interesting also I will keep the episode length to 20 minutes uh, if I remember best thing to remember is setting a timer which I'm doing right now um, you know the orange genius my second personality has this bad habit of having 40 minute episodes all the time when I don't think about it and I'd rather not I'd rather not and um, well apart from that there's been some stability problems with my recording software so whenever everything crashes I'm gonna be right back I don't hope it crashes I, I hope it doesn't crash though that only happened on the loading screen and when I adjusted any resolution or any graphics uh, we'll we'll just start up and I'll see what I can expect we're not gonna be playing in Swedish because I do not speak a word of Swedish like literally I don't think I know a single word nope we're gonna be playing in English Else hard dot break and a couple of brackets. So that's literally what it's called in my Steam library. So it's a very intriguing name to a video game. It's also got the tag hacking in on the Steam store. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, that looks like software crashing. No? Everything okay? Everything okay? Evidently. No. Oh. No reaction from the video game. Yeah, this is going to be heartbreaking every time. Oh, everything's going good. No problems here. And then he told me that he wouldn't accept the terms of the agreement. Can you believe it? But I made him sign in the end. Hmm, can we talk about something other than work, please? It's Sebastian's birth birthday after all. It's fine, Mom. Can we start on the cake soon? Exactly. Well, I like cake. Can we start on the cake soon? Yes, in a, win in, in a minute. I thought we should sign for you. Find sign for you first. That's a phone ringing. A call now. Honey, could you answer the phone, dude? It's already been like four minutes since. The, I've got a mouthful of food. I always answer answer the phone around here. It's been like ten minutes since it started ringing. Can we wait a little longer? Dad, pass me the cake knife, please. Gah. Uh, I'll get it, mother. There's never been a phone call for you, has there? But by all means, go ahead. 
Like, that person's been there for 20 minutes now. I better not make them wait. Click on the ground to move around. Yeah, I fiddled around with that. And the phone is right here. Dude, that's got a sick vibration feature on it. Look at that. You can interact with things by clicking at them. What? I literally have it in my hands. Uh, telephone. Answer. Yes? Is this Sebastian? Uh, yep. But I prefer Seb. You applied for one of our open positions. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. Soda salesman. Three months ago, probationary employment. Three months probationary employment. Uh, uh, I did? Oh, yeah, that's right. Yes, and you probably know you lack any proper qualifications. But we have a position that no one else has shown any interest in. Oh, that's great. Uh, really? Okay. That's good. Okay. It's not here in the city, though. You'll have to travel a bit. We'll cover all travel expenses, of course. Including a stay at a local hotel. A stay. Okay, where am I going? All inclusive? Oh, that sounds like a pretty sweet deal after all. Sure. At Wellspring, we care deeply for our employees. And for our customers. Okay, where am I going? All inclusive? Well, breakfast included, probably. You'll have to sort out the rest yourself. Okay, where am I going? The place is called Dorisburg. In all honesty, I don't know much about the city. Are you familiar with it? Dorisburg. Never heard of it. Yeah, it sounds vaguely familiar. My grandfather's from there. No, he's not. Never heard of it. Nah, it's hardly a, metrop a metropolis. But to the heart of the matter, are you interested in this opportunity? We'll need an answer as soon as possible. Sounds good to me. Can I sleep on it? It all feels a little rushed. Yeah, getting a phone call and just the dude saying, You can start now. Go. It's uh, not what I, you know, do in my life. All feels a little rushed. Yeah, I understand that. But this kind of opportunity doesn't come up too often. Oh yes, I forgot to mention that we have a salesman on site in the city. He'll show you the ropes and help you get started. Oh, okay. Hmm. That sounds good. Ah, right. That sounds good. Okay, splendid. You'll be going there by boat, ship 340. It'll be departing early tomorrow morning from the harbor. Don't be late. Tomorrow morning? In Dorisburg, you'll be staying at a hotel called... Hmm, my, my papers say Devotchka. What? Devotchka? What? Okay. Devotchka? Just so. I'm sure it's super cozy. Unless you have any more questions, I think we can end our little conversation here. Okay, I'm psyched. Just one thing. A ship? But wait. Sir, there are a number of other calls I have to make tonight. But if that'll be all... We hope you'll enjoy being part of the Wellspring family. Good night. Uh, uh, so, I, I got the job? Good night. I don't think he heard the good night part. Use the arrow keys or WASD to rotate the camera. Yeah, zoom in, zoom out. Can't zoom further in than this. All right, mouse button. Okay. Okay. That's gonna... I'm gonna get used to that at some point, probably. Can I turn on the light? 
What's going on with my... Let's put down that phone. That looks stupid. You don't hold the empty phone to your head. Dude, I've been I've been in a phone call for two hours now. Let's get let's get on eating that cake though. Gotta eat that cake. Okay, guys, I'm gonna watch some TV. No, you ate all the cake. Oh, thanks for the cake. That that's not. Who was that on the phone, Sebastian? It was about that job. Oh, I got it. They wanted me real bad. That's wonderful. When do you start? Real soon. I gotta catch a ship tomorrow morning. You better get some proper sleep then and write down that ship number, otherwise you're gonna forget. Hmm. Do I have a bed? Oh, he literally turned on the TV, didn't he? What is that? Turn off! What are you doing? What is it, son? Turn that thing on. What are you watching? <laughs> the news. Yeah, it looked like it. It's important. Sebastian. There's a lot going on out in the world. Uh, yeah, I'm going to turn it on. There. Watch your quote-unquote news. The person is sleeping. Wow. Okay. Very interesting. How about you? What do you have to say, Mom? What is it, Sebastian? I'm going to bed now. I'll go do some homework in my room. What? Whoever says that? That cake was yummy. I didn't have any. Well... Good. Let's be polite here. Uh, I'll do some homework. No, I'm not. I'm going to bed now. Good night. Can I do anything? Are those, are those pancakes? Turn on the stove. I'm not turning on the stove. Turn on the water in the sink. Uh, yeah, sure. Turn off the water in sink. That's a... Uh, that's a... What? Inspect? trash can. Yeah. Hmm. That's interesting. It's, it feels a little like a point-and-click adventure. Can I have that knife? Can I, you know, grab that knife? No. That's a knife right there. Can you see that? Wait, wait. Camera is hard. That's, that right there is a knife. I just don't have the hitbox, do I? I'm not getting that knife, am I? Okay. I'm gonna have to fiddle around with the camera c controls. Pick up water. Pick up bun. Water, 100%. I'm definitely picking up a water. And putting it in my bag? 100% water. That seems like a I've got a credit card. Check balance. That's impressive work. That's a super futuristic credit card that you can just, you know, push a button on and it says, Oh, you've got this much money. Also, very unfortunate if a um, burglar gets it in his hand. Let's put the, <laughs> let's put it down. Put it into the bag. Uh, I just had a pick up bun. Eat bun. No, I'm going to put all that in my bag. Pick up all the buns. Dad didn't eat, uh, didn't eat his bun. I'm going to put that in the bag. Gonna put your bun in the bag. I wonder how much space there is in the bag. And I wonder if food spoils. I hope not. I'm gonna put that all in the bag because people have to eat and drink. Drinking is probably more important than eating. Can I have the cake though? Like literally, I want the cake. And the, kn the knife could be useful as well. Well, I guess I'm gonna go. What was that? That is probably the trash can thing. Yeah. That's different. Oh, that's more... That's booze. Pick up booze. Sebastian! I need that for later. No, you don't. 
No, you don't. You were sleeping. Can't talk to sleeping person. Let's turn that off. Unbelievable. This guy. Anything else here? Doesn't seem like it. I, I wonder where my bed is. Probably out the door. Uh. Ooh. Bunch of stuff. Open door. I don't see a door. That's a cat. That's really cool. Open door. It's a... Uh, that's a um, room back there. It's also a room. It's no cheats. Man, it's 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 uh, almost 1 a.m. The door is locked. I've got to sleep now. Maybe brush my teeth too. Time flies. I don't want to be I don't want to be sleep deprivated when when entering that or going aboard that ship. This seems like my room. Sleep in bed. Who sleeps in bed? I guess I sleep in bed. Is that a magazine? I'm not gonna, I'm not, why are there stars? Never mind. Let's go to sleep. We've done enough here. He didn't even change. He didn't even change into comfortable clothes. El Huervo. Eric Svedang, those are the developers. Tobias Sjorgren. Oscar Rydelius. Johannes Gotlin. I hope I didn't butcher any of those names. If so, I'm sorry. Else heartbreak. Also, I am going to turn down the volume of that. I'm sorry, I hope I don't forget that in editing, but on my end it was really loud. That's the boat. That's the boat. It's, it's again the same time in the evening. What do I have in my bag? Exactly. Exactly. Only one important thing, though. Um, pick up cola. That's empty. Well, let's throw that into the trash can. Throw cola into the trash. Throw cola into the trash can. Right mouse button. Okay. Like a good person. That's a full cola. I'm gonna put that into the bag. Anything else? I can sleep on the bed. I'm not sleeping on the bed. What's going on in the TV? What's going on in the world? Yeah. No. No. Someone's got to do something with the antenna. It's not happening. I'm not sitting down. That's a turn on water sink. Can I brush my teeth? No. What if I inspect trash can? Does it say there's a smells funky? It doesn't say that there's ice can't see what's in the trash. Why can you not see what's in the trash? So that's uh, something I should remember if I've whoa. if I've got something like a credit card in my hand I can not throw it in the trash can. Okay, that's good. That's very convenient. I like how I've got 565 bucks with me right now. What is that? Yeah, I can open the door, but but seriously, what is that S? Does that stand for? Ah, oh, that's a five. That is a five. This room is probably locked. A door is locked. How about number three? Let's enter a random room and talk to a person. Because in video games, I'm not shy. The door is locked. This one is probably not locked. It can't be locked. The door is locked. This uh, staircase is completely warded off. It's like there's an invisible barrier in front of it that I, you know, you can't just get over that fence. 
It's not possible. You can't enter. No one's ever done it before. Can't go over there either. Oh, and that would be my timer. So, just in case, I don't think the time advances in the menu screen. And thus, I will end my episodes on the menu screen because I don't know what um, impact the timer has on the gameplay. If I had stayed and explored the last area for a long time, he said that the ship would leave early, early the next morning. Had I been too late, would the ship have left without me? I wonder. I wonder. In real life, that definitely would have happened. But in real life, you, you know, if you have a phone, the phone ringing. The guy on the other side doesn't wait 30 minutes long for 30 minutes for you to pick the phone up because you have to figure out who gets the phone and who gets to eat the cake. That doesn't happen in real life. Let's not dwell on that for the moment. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope I'll see you around. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you then. Bye bye.